Anybody else fancy joining me on a road trip, a bit of a tour of the Balkans, a tour of Yugoslavia? I definitely do. Strap in, buckle up. It's going to be a bumpy long ride, and not just because of the state of the roads. Welcome to Reuniting Yugoslavia. Buirum and welcome to episode 1 of Reuniting Yugoslavia. I am so excited about this save. This is going to be this is going to be the best save ever. Hands down, best save that I've ever done. Period. Yeah, before we get into the full kind of whole shebang of the whole thing, I just want to say massive thank you to Wiry, Weary, Weary, I think, um who's actually sorted this database out and got the complete pyramids for pretty much every single league in the universe that ever exists so i'll link that down below if anyone wants to check that out and use it for themselves so as you can see as the title suggests we're gonna be going on a tour around former yugoslavia all the countries that made up yugoslavia and basically trying to win something and then move on to the next country and tick it off our checklist so We've got seven countries here loaded. So we've got Slovenia, we've got Bosnia, Croatia, Kosovo, Montenegro, North Macedonia, and Serbia. I've loaded in their second, only only down to their second kind of leagues, because if I go any further, I'm just going to have an absolute mass, <laughs> an absolute mass of teams there, and it's just going to be a waste, pretty much. So the basic, basic rules of this save is going to be, I'm going to give myself 20 years, 20 in-game years from the time of when I get my first job to either win a cup, win a domestic cup, Win a European Cup, because you never know. Um, win a domestic title or promote a team, depending on if we get a team kind of in the uh, in the lower leagues of each league to get them promoted. That's going to count uh, either by winning or actually getting them promoted via any sort of playoffs, etc. Or taking these national teams to a massive kind of cup competition, e.g. World Cup or the European Championships. I can only buy players from these countries. If a team obviously buys a player from the outside, then I'm just still going to use him. But yeah, for me, I won't be able to buy any players. So that's going to make it very, very interesting. And we're just going to be relying on our Balkan Balkan blood to be providing these, these players that we need. And I know uh, players from you know kind of southern eastern europe they are very very strong and there are plenty of wonder kids i'm hoping for the same in this save as well but yeah you'll see on the next screen we're going to be starting unemployed we're also going to start as a sunday league no badges no coaching no anything no anything just a random just a random buyer off the street he's found him come and manage some team in the balkans i'm like all right well that not a problem not a problem and like I mentioned, we're going to have no coaching badges, Sunday league footballer, and we'll just cater it more towards motivating. We're going to channel our inner Mr. Motivator and get the job done. And I've got a nice little way, instead of me, you know, nitpicking here and there, which country, which team I want to, you know, want to manage. We're going to use a little program that I found that's going to throw me in right at the deep end. And I will cut to that right now. The Wheel of Fortune, Colo Srece. We're gonna the wheel, the wheel. You know that from Star Wars. Ah, oh, the claw. But yeah, the wheel. Who's in charge here? The claw. The claw is our master. We're gonna let the wheel decide which country. So we got Bosnia, Croatia, Serbia, North Macedonia, Montenegro. Slovenia and Kosovo. The wheel is deciding it's all up to the people so let's let's let the wheel decide and then whatever the outcome of the wheel is that is the country that we have to take a job in first so we apply for whatever jobs available in that country and then if there's kind of if there's multiple clubs in that country that have offered us a job then we uh you know what we do we get back to the colosrechi the wheel of fortune and we input those clubs into this and then we let the wheel decide again 
So, without further ado, let's get it spun, people. Let's get the wheel spun. Oh, this is massive. Massive. Where are we going? Where are we going? Ooh. So, we are heading to Slovenia. So, the wheel has chosen Slovenia as our first country to pick a job in. So... Let's head over, let's, let's get into it. Let's see what Slovenia has to offer. Right, here we are. We've loaded up everything, gone through all the shenanigans, the managers, all that stuff. And as you've just seen, the Wheel of Fortune, the Wheel of Balkan Fortune, it selected Slovenia. And Slovenia is the country that we have to go and get a job in first, pretty much before we can, uh, you know, start our little road trip around the Balkans. As of now, there is only one team that needs a manager, and that is Triglav in the Slovenian Second League. So, apply. Apply. That is the only job we can currently do. The rest of those jobs in Macedonia, Bosnia, Kosovo, Montenegro, no good to us. Absolutely no good to us. And they've... Well, well. That's, yeah... That's not fun. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not good. They've just straight up denied me. Um, this this is gonna it's gonna take a while. It looks like it's gonna take a while. So, any but Slovenia, Slovenia, anyone, please, any more, any more jobs, any more jobs going? No, right. Well, I'll I'll see you when there's some more Slovenian jobs. <laughs> Triglav went with Sinisha Berkic. I could have done. I mean, oh, ooh. I mean, I, I see why they've gone for him because he's Triglav through and through. But come on, a bit of bit of fresh blood, a bit of new blood. You can't. You same old, same old. You need a bit of change. A bit of change is, is never hurt anyone. There's so many jobs and stuff being filled, literally <laughs> all over the place. Look, they've they've shortened down. That list was absolutely huge, and I'm just seeing people take jobs. But yeah. Slovenia. I just have to wait for it and I don't, I'm kind of guessing I don't think it's going to happen anytime soon so we have to wait for the Slovenian kind of season to start and then once players, or not even players, once managers start getting given the boot then we can actually start applying and trying to get our foot in the door somewhere inside Slovenia so yeah, I'm you know, just waiting game I guess, waiting game I think we got done slightly dirty a little bit with the Wheel of Fortune and the Colo Srici. Slovenia, to be fair, was probably one of the harder ones we could have got to try and land in a job immediately because I feel like Kosovo, Bosnia, Macedonia, you know, kind of any of those ones, it would have been relatively easy to jump in and get straight into it. But here's what it is: the the wheel, the wheel spoke, and we have to we have to take heed of the wheel, even though we have to wait like nine years now to get a job, but. It'll be all worth the wait. All worth it. It's not a job opening as of yet, but Almir Soleimanovic at Rudal Rudal Rudar Velenje in the Slovenian second tier has an insecure job status. <laughs> Woo! Uh, <laughs> this could be Rudar Velenje Velenje could be our first potential job landing. So Keep it switched, keep it locked and loaded. We might be ready to pull the trigger on Rudar Velenje if Almir loses his job. This will. I'll keep my eye on it and I will come back in case anything happens. But Rudar, might be you lot. Another one. We have our first two job op possible, possible opportunities. So we've got NK Fuzinar Ravne, who have just sacked Robert Corrin. Who's the ex Hull player? Hull player, ex Hull player. They got rid of him. 2020 to 2020. Walk out the door, you see someone that you know, and they ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Finish, don't want you, Robert. Get out, slingy hook. Also, like I just mentioned, the Kirka one, they got rid of uh, Mr. Zoran there. That's two player, two players. That's that's two clubs now we can actually apply for because Slovenia. So apply, Kirka, apply. 
received, received, right. Well, let's, let's see if we get any uh, interviews. Hopefully we do. Hopefully we can get an interview with either one of these teams and get our foot in that Slovenian shaped door and get on to, uh, just get on to some management. Let's get on to some management. And I know it's a bit Dom Jale, who are a top tier, I think, still, Slovenian team, have an insecure manager. I'd love that. <laughs> that would be so lucky. But to get jump in straight to that, just bypass everyone and get into Dom Jale straight away. Give, give me that. Give me it. Give me that. But let's see. Let's see if we get any job interviews. Oh, nothing yet. It's just the press. It's just the press. What do the press want? I don't care about the press. I want an interview. Give me an interview. Is this it? It's not. Is this another job we can apply for though? Serbia. No. I nearly, I nearly made some fire between my hands then. Rubbing them so hard together. But Fuzina are the first team that have offered us an interview. Let us attend. Right. I'm glad you've given me the chance. Merely, merely considering my options. Merely, I'm conv I can, I can do anything you want me to do. Anything you want me to do, I will do it without a issue. Long and successful career. There might be a little bit of a white lie um, there, considering this is a Balkan journeyman. <laughs> but uh, it's it's all right. It's all right. No, everyone everyone's told a little pork here and there. Right, what do they want? Work within two years, blah, blah, blah. Second league, mid-table and fifth round. Work towards gaining. Da, 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 da. Cool. Happy. Mid-table. Cool. 34 and a half K. Not cool, but I'll agree just because I want a job. So, cool. No requests. Happy days. And that is our first job in Slovenia with Fuzina up. So, let's see if we get another one. Or if another team sacks their manager, and then we can apply for that. But for now, Fuzinar looks like one of the teams that could be a possibility that we start with. Right, so Fuzinar have approached us on a one-year deal. However, I've got a couple in... Well, I've just got one other interview that I'm waiting on. So I want to see if that comes through. And I just want to show you this as well. The fact that Domjale, their last in the Slovenia first league and they're very insecure he could be on the verge of losing that job and then another one uh, here with Mura another job so I'm just waiting on those ones I'm going to delay it hopefully they accept the lay if not it's fuzzy now it is fuzzy now and we replace Robert Corrin so let's see if they accept the delay and then that way we can head back to the wheel of fortune and see what the wheel says so delay They've accepted it. Right, let's see if we get any more interviews. And here we are, like I predicted. Kirka has come in and offered us an interview. So let's get, let's crack on with it. Pretty much I'm just going to click the same things that, <laughs> that, that, that the last team asked me because it's a bit, it's just a bit samey, samey, the interviews. I have no requests. Leave me in. Happy days. So now we've done interviews with Fuzina and Kirka, hopefully Kirka actually give us an offer as well so then we can actually head back to the wheel again and see what the wheel says but like I mentioned I'm still waiting and want to see if Dom Jale get rid of their manager because that would be an unreal job to jump into straight away if we can, uh, hopefully we can, I hope they get rid of him before because I'm going to delay again and see if Fuzina accept the delay and hopefully Kirka actually give us Ooh, right here we are hopefully they accept that delay again right cool um next one i don't think they will accept it <laughs> so dom jarl they have to hurry up if they're gonna sack the manager sod's law they sack the manager after i have to choose and mora is another one that is another team in slovenia that we can apply for i think yeah it is first league as well so apply for that another one we've applied for mora and Kirka have now come in as well. See, they're lining up. They're, we have to wait. We have to wait till November. But jobs are lining up. We are going to delay again just because of the Mora one. See if we get an interview there. If we can, cool. If not, we've got two two clubs that want us. Accept, cool. Accepted it. Right. Let's see if Mora give us a a job interview. Hopefully they do. 
I just randomly Goraj there from Bosnia. <laughs> they want me to be their manager, which is a little bit random. But uh, I would if I was allowed Goraz, Goraz there, but I can't. So, sorry. Right, here we are back with the Fuzinar one. I don't think we're actually going to be able to kind of decline again. Purely because I think you get three times and then they kind of decline it and want an answer straight away. So we might have to head to the Wheel of Fortune straight away. Let's try and delay it. But we might have to go and just put Fuzinar and Kirka there and take whatever whatever the wheel says we have to take so let's try another delay they've rejected it you know what time it is Fifty-fifty chance fuzina or kirka we have to accept one of the offers from these two clubs so will it be fuzina or will it be kirka let's let's find out let's find out which one of these two it has to be Fuzina or Kirka? Fuzina or Kuka? It's Fuzinar. The team that wanted us, the first team that wanted us, and it's them. Let's get back to FM and accept that offer from Fuzinar. So here we are, back at the first team that wanted us initially, NK Fuzinar. Ravne. I haven't even looked at anything apart. <laughs> I just haven't looked at anything. I don't even know what they're about, where they are, but they want us. That is the plain and simple of it is that they want us. One year contract, 425 quid a week. I won't spend it all at once. Beautiful stuff. So I want us to work within budget. Minimum two year contracts for first team players. Mid table, fifth round of the Slovenian Cup. Work towards getting promotion to the first league and automatic promotion to the first league. So start negotiations let's start these negotiations eight eight month contract <laughs> i mean there's not much we can do but finalize the deal happy the job's been accepted nk fuzinar ravne